No one wanted to adopt this 21-year-old senior cat. But when this woman saw him online, things were about to change. Welcome to Amazing Truth Channel. Do not forget to subscribe and activate the bell button to receive all new. Now go to the story. Standing out from the pack isn't always easy, but for Tigger, an elderly cat at the local shelter, it was a matter of survival. As most of the animals around him had been visited and picked over the last three years, Tigger never left. Each time a new visitor came to the shelter, his thin brown tail would wag with excitement. He took a while to get to his feet, but once he did, they had already moved on to the next animal. The local manager of the shelter felt especially bad for Tigger. That's because at his age, the manager knew that it was unlikely any adopters would pick him. Most of the people who came in were young couples or families looking to give a cat a new home. They wanted to watch them grow up together as a family. But at 21 years old, Tigger didn't have too many years left in him. He had been a trusty companion for decades and even outlived his owner. By the end of her life, his owner had been stuck in a wheelchair at a retirement home, but Tigger made all the difference. Tigger would sit on her lap every day, which helped keep her spirits up. The nurses swore that Tigger added at least a few years to her life. After his owner had passed away, there wasn't any family to give the cat to. The retirement home didn't know what to do either, so they sent him to the local animal shelter where they were hesitant to take him. It was just a small shelter on the outskirts of Rochester, Minnesota, so the chances of finding Tigger a new life were slim. Even when customers were looking for a cat, normally they wanted a kitten. They wanted a small, fluffy, and cute cat with plenty of energy. Tigger didn't move around too much. He was too old for that. The thought of dealing with the health problems, medicine, and vet appointments of an elderly cat was enough to put most people off. But Adrian isn't most people. She wasn't even looking for a cat, which is why the one she ended up with was the one that nobody else wanted. Adrian lived in a small condo 20 minutes from Rochester. She worked as a waitress part-time and didn't have time for many friends. She had moved back from New York to take care of her elderly mother, who was now almost 70. Her mother lived in her little condo with her. Back in New York, Adrian had just started to have some success in her acting career. She had been given a good role in an off-Broadway play, but once her sister told her that their mother had been diagnosed with Alzheimer's and needed help, she dropped everything. Their mother had given them everything. They never had much money, but they always had food on the table and plenty of love in the house. She considered herself lucky. Many of the people she went to school with didn't have much to be grateful for. That's why there was no question in her mind about what she needed to do. She quit her job, gave up her apartment, and moved back to Rochester. First, her mother refused any help. She wanted Adrian to go chase her dreams, and she was pretty stubborn too. But Adrian insisted. She had plenty of time to chase her dreams when she was older, she said. For now, family was the most important thing. That was two years ago. Now, Adrian had been living with her mother every day, and it was getting harder. Her mother couldn't get up and walk anymore and talked less and less. The doctors had tried all kinds of medicine, group meetings and activities to try and energize her, but nothing seemed to work. The answer came to her totally by chance one day as she was surfing the web on her computer. Adrian stumbled across something she noticed an advertisement in the corner of the page that popped out at her. It was a call for help from the Rochester Animal Shelter. The ad featured a picture of a small brown and gray cat with big, beautiful eyes. The cat was scruffy and had a kind of strength to her that Adrian couldn't quite put her finger on. Something about this cat stood out to her. She clicked on the ad which took her to a website with all of the different animals. Adrian spent more than 10 minutes scrolling through the website's gallery, but couldn't find any sign of the cat she had seen earlier. So the next day, Adrian decided to head down to the shelter to have a look for herself. When she arrived, the lady at the desk took her on a tour of the compound where all the animals were kept. First, they went to see all of the kittens, puppies, and young animals that most people came for. But Adrian knew the one she wanted to see. I saw a cat online yesterday, she told the lady. It had brown and gray hair, was quite small, and looked a little worn out. Adrian looked around, but still couldn't see any sign of the cat. The woman raised her eyebrows and was taken off guard. 
You don't mean Tigger, do you? She asked, motioning for Adrian to follow her down the hall. Once they arrived at the back corner of the building, Adrian looked behind the cage wall and saw a small cat resting. The woman introduced the cat as Tigger and began to tell Adrian her story. She had been a loyal cat to an elderly lady who recently passed away, but she had to warn Adrian that Tigger was pretty old. How old? Adrian asked. That's when she learned that Tigger was 21. Since most cats lived until around 14, she was gobsmacked. Tigger was only five years younger than Adrian. This may sound crazy, Adrian said, but I think that's why I was drawn to him. The lady opened the cage and the cat got slowly to its feet. She wandered towards them and rubbed her head against Adrian's leg. From that moment, Adrian knew that there was something special. But Adrian didn't realize how special until she took her back to the house. When Adrian arrived home, her mother had no idea that she was even thinking of getting a cat. She was surprised, but she didn't have the energy to protest or fight about it. That's when something extraordinary happened. Tigger immediately found Adrian's mother and jumped up onto her lap. The old lady was taken by surprise and her eyes widened. But as Tigger settled in and curled into a ball on her lap, she found that it was oddly comforting. Over the next few days, Adrian noticed that her mother had an incredible recovery. Her spirits were high, she was talking more, and she was even starting to get up and move around from time to time. But that wasn't all. Tigger was going to change Adrian's life too. She just didn't know it yet, and it happened in the strangest of ways. Adrian found the way that Tigger supported her mother so heartwarming that she took a video of them together. They would get up together, both very slowly, and follow each other around the room. Adrian uploaded the video to Facebook for her friends and family, but it didn't take long for it to go viral. Before she knew it, there were thousands of people liking and commenting about how sweet it was. No one could believe that the cat was 21 years old. And it wasn't just the public who were interested. A reporter from a local TV station even asked Adrian for an interview. She didn't believe it was real at first. But then he came to Adrian's house with a cameraman to sit down and talk about her story. He asked her what inspired her to adopt such an old cat. She told him that she could see something special about Tigger and how much the cat had helped her mother improve. The interview didn't get too much attention, but the local reporter learned about Adrian's former career as an actor and offered to get her in touch with a local producer. It was incredible. She definitely wasn't expecting that. Adrian had the opportunity to pursue her passion in her hometown, but she did hesitate. After all, she was in Rochester to take care of her mother. After talking about it together, though, her mother insisted that she'd take the opportunity. She was feeling much better with Tigger around. Not only did Tigger bring Adrian's mother newfound health, but she also gave Adrian a new start in life. Who knew that the solution to all her problems would be found in the back corner of an animal shelter? What an incredible story. Let me know what you thought of it in the comments below. If you like the story, surely the next video that's appearing on your screen will move you too. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, give us a thumbs up, and activate the notification bell so you won't miss any of our next videos. A huge kiss, and see you in the next story.